Hey guys, um, I just want to show you how you can possibly solve the gear cube just a few seconds faster. Um, if you don't know how to solve a uh, gear cube already, I highly suggest you tech you check out um, Red KB's tutorial, and I'll post a link somewhere. But if you do know how to solve a gear cube, and um, you've done it by uh, Red KB's instructions, you do know that when you have a ring where all the edges are in the correct spots and just need to be oriented you just turn the cube uh, four times and then uh, it'll be solved okay so I'll do this one two three four like that but there will also be times where you're in the same situation but when you turn it four times one two three four it still won't be solved even though all the edges are still in the correct spots that's because there's like there's a certain way that you can tell if you turn four times clockwise or four times counterclockwise or you can say R and then RI. Here's how you know if you turn R or turning four times clockwise. If you're looking at a face, you know the center color, this one happens to be blue, and the color on the edge is facing towards the left going that way, then that's when you know you have to turn um, the cube uh, R clockwise like this. So you go one, two, three, four, and it's solved. Now, here's how you know if you turn it counterclockwise. If the color that's on your face on your edge is facing to the right that way, see it's going that way, and that's when you need to uh, turn RI or counterclockwise four times. One, two, three, four. And it's solved. It doesn't really matter. You don't have to start with blue. It happens with any color. See, here's red is the face, and red is uh, going up towards the right. Green's the face, and green's going up towards the right. So either way, you have to go uh, counterclockwise or RI to solve it. See, sometimes uh, when you're solving the gear cube and you just keep on turning, eventually it will solve, but it'll eat away a few seconds off your time. So there you go. I hope that was helpful, and that's how you possibly can solve the gear cube a little bit faster.